Tady je další. Mr. Jensen, it's Nomad Stanek. Please, please, you must help. Mr. Stanek, how did you... My daughter. They're going to kill her. I gave your friends the slip, and when, when I got to here... Where? The Prakaska district. An apartment complex behind the laundromat. Please, hurry. Adam, you okay? Those drones... I'm fine. Whoever sent them didn't succeed. Oh, thank God for that. Listen, Jane has just called. Versa Life is closing their account, moving everything out of that data vault tonight. This can't wait. You gotta get over there now. I can't. I found the bomb maker. She can tell us everything. But she's about to be killed. What? Shit, man. They're cleaning up blue sands. I can't break into a bank. Not by myself. And if we don't do this now, we lose the orchid. Fuck! But if I don't go to the Prokowska district, the bomb maker dies, and we're back to square one. <sighs> Your call, man. What took you so long? You need to get in there. What is this place? This is where they're holding my daughter. After I evaded your agents, I followed one of those fanatics, and he led me here. Where is she? He said she was on one of the upper floors, but no one is allowed to go up there. These lunatics are armed. They'll shoot anyone who tries. Oh, what are they going to do to her? It's okay. Mr. Stanek, stay here. I'll take care of it. So many have found their way here. will grow beyond the bounds of flesh. Good evening, Strong. And also, <gasps> ah, you came. I knew you would. Our time has been brought to a break in last night. Many one one of the flesh the last our time, time here to grow short. You're not going to the bank, are you? Like I said, the bomb maker. Can tell us everything, I know. But we're talking about a bioweapon, Adam. Once that vault is cleared out, whatever information was stored on the orchid will be wiped clean. Gone. Yeah, I get it. Time is the enemy right now, Adam. I hope you reconsider.
sacrifice for our freedom! Probably not. find this bomb maker, Adam, because I just watched a convoy of armored vans leaving the bank. VersaLife cleared everything out. Yep, we just lost the best chance we had to find out how to counter the Orchid. Wanted. Who's here? What's going on out there? I told you I was not to be disturbed. Oh my. Come in. Come in and let me see you. How did you get in here? And how did you know to come now? Tonight of all nights, when we are finally ready to answer the call of the Machine God's infinite wisdom. Surely, your arrival here is not coincidental. I'm looking for Allison Stanek. <laughs> of course you are. And you have found her on the eve of her greatest achievement. But do you seek counsel, assistance in your prayers or meditations? Or are you here to join us? 
to free yourself from this prison of flesh and give yourself to the glory of the singularity. If there is any way your High Priestess can be of assistance to you, I am more than happy to provide. I want to ask you about the bombs you built for the attack on Ruzika Station. Is that all? My augmented brother Victor is a brave man and a great leader. When he asked me to build some of my little ones for him, I was proud to accept. I know Victor. If he's behind these attacks, I'd like to have a talk with him. After our flesh flood oppressors sent one of their dogs to murder Talos Racker, Victor moved his base of operations to a research center in the Swiss Alps. Garm, I believe it is called. Garm? Okay, I got it. That is why you came here? You entered this sacred place to solicit my help against Victor's holy revolution? Treat! Blasphemer! And I believed you were one of us. I am. I just have a more inclusive idea of who us is. <laughs> then you have become their willing slave. But not I. I have felt the boots of the police as they spat on me and mocked me for who I was. I could have lain down, like you. But I persevered. And the machine god has given me my reward. I emerged from the crucible, enlightened. Enlightenment is a state of elevated perception and wisdom. You seem to be a little short on both. If you were wrong about why I'm here, I bet you're wrong about a lot of other things too. I admit when you first arrived, I was in the middle of something, and that distracted me from the true reason for your visit. But who could have anticipated one such as you would side with our enemies? They steal from us, they rape and murder us. They are animals, and animals go extinct while technology perseveres. Victor is killing everyone, not just the abusers, but innocent people. People like your father, who's never been anything but supportive and forgiving. Father, such a sweet man. I can only hope Victor's attacks will continue to spare him. Continue? You mean there's gonna be more of them? Well, you don't think I built only three of my little ones for him, do you? I gave him enough to destroy the entire city. Now, if you will excuse me, I must get back to what I was doing before you came. Hey, we're not done here. Allison? Oh, shit. It is time, Chief. It is time now. The body is the prison. Augmentations are the key. The consciousness is all. Cast off the bounds of flesh and blood. Embrace the singularity. Alice, stop! I know what you're doing. I've seen this kind of tech before. It ended badly. You are concerned with our lives. You do not need to worry, brother. Only this physical body will die. Our minds will depart our corporeal shells and merge with the infinite consciousness of the Machine God. This is the Ascension. I would invite you to come with us, but there is no more room. I'm more interested in preventing another attack. What's Victor's next target? I do not know, and it does not matter. I am on the threshold of a new existence. When I become one with the Machine God, the artificial burdens of this physical plane will no longer bother me. Of course they will. Your mind's made up of thoughts and memories. If that's the part of you moving on, you'll be taking all your rage and pain along with you. Good God. Hey, I had not thought of that. It seemed to me that this was my only chance. The world is made up of nothing but agony and suffering. Or the futile struggle to avoid them. Moments of happiness are quickly shattered by this reality. The Ascension is our only hope of deliverance.
Not the only one. You've seen the worst that life has to offer, but you're still trying to make things better. And in spite of it all, you believe that it's possible. Everything you need is right here in this room. You are your best hope for deliverance. Brother, you... Your faith in me. Your beautiful trust. I am overcome. It cannot be coincidence that you have made yourself known to me on this most holy of occasions. You are a sign from the Machine God that I am to remain here a little while longer. I am not yet ready to ascend. I will spread wisdom to the rest of the world. My job in this world is to stop people like Victor, and I need your help to do that. Of course, my dear Prophet. I am honored to assist you. Please, wait here. Take this. You can use it to defuse my little ones. It felt good for a change. To build something that saves lives instead of taking them. Agent Jensen? Over here. I am under arrest. People's lives were cut short, Allison. Because of bombs you made. None of my children will suffer for what I did. You have my word. When you confront Victor, be merciful. Remember, he is your brother. Right. Smiley, Stanek and the rest course are on the way back in now. I need to talk to Miller. He back yet? No, but just a sec. I'll get him on the line. Jensen, you and Pletcher find something? It's bigger than we thought. Where can I meet you? At Chicane's place. We're flying there now. Miller out. Jensen, you still got that calibrator on you? If you do, man, I'm ready to optimize that crazy system of yours. I got everything I need now to fix you up real good. You mean the way you fixed me up last time? No, no, no. This is gonna be different, huh? On Vaclav's honor. Just get to the lab and you'll see. I saw your goons again. Why did they take her? She is the victim here. Mr. Stanek, she confessed to the crime. She made the bombs. Hundreds of people were killed. And now she's accepting the consequences of her actions. But they manipulated her! Corrupted her! No. They didn't. But... I'm sorry. It could have been much worse. You're right. I know. You did what you could. Thank you, Mr. Jensen. Not now, Mr. Jensen. I... I need to be alone. Great. Another one. I need to grieve in peace. Great. Another one. Adam? It's Arya. I just heard what happened. God, right outside your apartment? What happened outside my apartment? Someone got all their implants torn out. Was left to bleed to death in the alley. When I first heard where it was, I thought... I'm fine, Arya. It wasn't me. Be careful going home. It's not the first one of these I've heard about. Adam, it's Delara. I managed to find out some information on that Marchenko guy you asked me to look into. What'd you get? Well, for starters, he wasn't always Victor Marchenko. He... Shit. I have to go. My appointment just showed up. I sent what I found to your email. Hope it helps. Thanks, Delara. I'll check it out. Hi, how are you? Sorry, I need to run. <laughs> are you still <laughs>
So you found the bomb maker? Linked everything to art? Not exactly. Jesus, Jensen. We did find the bomb maker. Allison Stanek, a local resident. We have her in custody now. But she told me she'd made dozens more bombs before we arrested her, and she delivered them to Viktor Marchenko. So it was Ark. Something more is going on here, Miller. Have you had a chance to backtrace the pocket secretary I gave you? Not yet, but I will, when I get back to the office. Good. Because Stanek also told me that Marchenko has a base of operations in the Swiss Alps. A research facility called GARM. That sound like something Ark has the resources for to you? I'll contact McCready. Get him and a few analysts to work up a plan. We need to move on this now. Chicane and I can fly there and back, get a lay of the land, while Mac and his team do the research. Really? Got it all figured out in that clockwork head of yours. Oh, what the hell? I'm in. You got enough fuel to get to Switzerland? To get us there, sure. Fine. Do it. But this is recon only. Do not engage. Contact me the minute you have something. Yes, sir. You've proven yourself so far on this one, Jensen. Don't screw it up. Tell me that. Miller is not used to giving compliments, is he? He's getting static from the brass. They're starting to riot in Gollum over that shit with Rucker. I'm sure he doesn't blame you. Much. Anymore. And what do you think? I think tracking that bomb maker was some fine work. If the intel you got from her stands true, Gollum City will be the least of our problems. So what do you say we go find out how deep in it we are, right? You all set? When we first talked, you told me that your limp kept you honest. That's an interesting way of looking at an injury. Your preamble's as thin as soup, man. Don't dance around it, just ask it. I'm only curious. We've all got a story. No, that's not it. What you really want to know is, do I hate him? Men that tore out my knee. His name was Lachlan Beats. He was a laborer. Worked in the mines up near Bendigo before everything went to hell. Beats was a family man who did what he thought he had to do in order to provide for his family. See, back then, nobody could compete with you Ogs when it came to manual labor jobs. So, he made a choice, if you can call it that. And his choice changed your life. You don't resent Beats for what happened? What I resent are the men who coaxed men like him to get augmentations. Men who enforced a system where the rich could buy artificial expertise without thinking about what it would cost all of us in the end. No, I don't resent him. At least not anymore. I was simply in the wrong place at the wrong time. Story of my life. So look, on that sunshiny note, what do you say we put some miles behind us? Yeah, fire it up.